So Dylan, tell us about the size and a little bit about your firm. So our company is almost up to 400 people right now. Um, we have 11 different service lines in 12 different locations. Uh, we're everywhere from Denver Metro all the way out to Indianapolis. Uh, our headquarters are here in Springfield, Missouri, where I am. Um, so we're in the environmental consulting industry, but really we do just about everything that uh, kind of falls under the environmental umbrella. Um, we kind of do everything from like environmental cleanups, like um, oil spills, train derailments or some of our, our, our bigger things. Um, we do industrial services like uh, manufacturing plant cleanups in there. Uh, we do water well drilling, underground storage tank inspections, uh, government compliance regulations. Uh, we really are like probably one of the few um, like full service environmental companies in the Midwest. And what was going on in your firm that triggered the need for this new solution? So it was, whenever I started at EWI, it was a little over five and a half years ago. And our employee count was like around 175, you know, not a, not a lot of huge growth, not a lot of new people coming in, um, kind of hung steady about that for a couple of years. Um, and then in the last 12 months, uh, 15 months, we've grown by, you know, over hundred people. Like I said, we're close to 400 employees now. So we've just had incredible growth, but you know, that rapid growth has just been a huge factor behind needing something like this. Um, you know, we've got, uh, employee information living in Vantage Point, employee information living in ADP, so like our two biggest databases that our, our company uses, um, housing all of the same information. And you know, our HR department having to go in and they're updating information, they're putting new information in, in ADP, turning around, putting the same information into Vantage Point for every single new employee. And then, like I said, we had a lot of new employees in just a short amount of time. And so on top of that, also kind of keeping up with all the current employees. It just was leading to less than perfect data. Um, we were finding just a growing number of inconsistencies between our two databases, and it just it, it wasn't it wasn't good. Um, a couple of years ago, our company had made um, just kind of a, a stronger push to get better data. Uh, we really wanted to to value our own data as like intellectual capital, but to get the better data out, we had to get better data in, and we just knew like the manual process between these two systems, just it wasn't getting the job done. Um, it was back at the Dell Tech Project Con last November where we were introduced the, to the uh, solution here. Like, yeah, we immediately knew this would be a, a huge benefit to our company, just would make a positive impact like, right away. And you, you already described this a little bit, but will you go it maybe um, in a little bit more detail, describe your process prior to implementing the ADP Black Box Connector and how that process impacted your firm prior yeah. to having the connector? Um, so the old process would have been an you know, employee, they start, um, they're having to go into ADP, they're filling out like all the, the new hire paperwork in there. But our HR department, they're also manually entering in employee records in ADP first. They're going and they're making sure that the employee's address is in there, their department, their supervisor job title. All that employee information is manually put into ADP and they turn around and also create an employee record in Vantage Point. And most of that same information that was already in ADP, they're now typing it all over again. So it's it's literally just the, the duplication of that, that data entry. Also, any employee that's already in the system, if they have any sort of change at all, like if they move, you know, their address has to get updated in both systems. Um, if they get a promotion or if they you know, have a, a pay change of some sort, all those things are you know, being updated in both systems. Um, employees can make changes themselves in ADP, which also means that if they can make an update in ADP, HR has to be notified, and then HR actually has to execute the change in Vantage Point. And so just that, that duplication of work. And then our, uh, our payroll cycle every two weeks, accounting and HR, they would have to review this entire payroll export, this, pay, this entire payroll report, verify that all the, the changes in the last two weeks have been carried out, you know, making sure that the employee's organization is correct, or you know, if someone changed from hourly to salary, um, and they're making sure they're updated there and their pay is reflected. Um, all those things, it just, it was a lot of, it took a lot of eyes, it took a lot of bodies just to, to make sure that that information was right, because messing with people's pay or making sure that uh, their employee information is correct is just, it's such a big deal. And what were some of the shortcomings of that process or, you know, the duplication of entry or this 
uh, lots of checking. What were some, mm -hmm. well, I kind of just answered the question. What were some <laughs> of the shortcomings of the process that you had previously? So it was, it was very manual, um, a very time consuming. It took a lot of people. It just took a lot of, a lot of checking, like you said, um, employees, if you know, they're entered in either system incorrectly, it's you know, negatively impacting our projects data. It's negatively impacting our financials, you know, not to mention like also creating a bad employee experience. Um, as an employee, you know, they go out and they get a promotion or if they have some sort of you know, pay change and it's not reflected on their pay stub, that's, that's a problem. Um, if they go into ADP and uh, maybe change the bank account information and then they get paid last week's per diem in the wrong bank account. And it's these things that required, you know, someone in HR to, to be updating and if they got missed, it was just negatively impacting the, the our employees. Um, also, like if they're, they have a department change or, you know, they got that pay raise and it wasn't actually um, updated in Vantage Point, you have wrong departments who are now carrying the cost of, you know, employees who don't actually work in their department anymore. Um, projects are showing too high of profitability because the pay rate wasn't actually updated. And so it's just giving this false sense of profit whenever that wasn't the case. Um, the HR department having to, you know, to duplicate the work, entering the same information in two different places is just, it wasn't scalable. And we were seeing that, you know, as the more we grew, we were just finding more and more mistakes just because the, the whole manual process just, it, it wasn't a solution long-term. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, so fast forward a little bit. Describe now what it's been like implementing the ADP Black Box Connector. The The whole process from start to finish has just been so, so stress-free. Um, right away, you know, one of the first things we did, we received was just this document to, to assist in the mapping. And so it had a list of all of our uh, the fields in ADP, all the fields in Vantage Point. Um, that way, we're not trying to to guess what they are. Um, I mean, 99% of the fields that we're already using are on this mapping document. And so it wasn't trying to, to, well, what is this field in ADP if it says it's this in Vantage Point? I mean, there's just that inconsistencies there. Um, we didn't have to, to be involved in that at all. I mean, it was all there. So really all that we had to do was just say, yes, connect these two fields. No, don't connect these two fields. It was, it was as easy as that. Um, once we kind of got going, you know, we're, we're going back and forth between uh, our full sale developers and our ADP representatives, um, our full sale partners were you know very helpful. They were quick to hop in if you know ADP is asking a question that you know we may not know because we're not coders. We don't we don't do the developing sort of thing, and so if we get asked questions that we don't know, our uh, partners were hopping in. They were helping out any way that they could, um, and then probably once we we got our database mapped, we were able to get in there and start doing testing. Uh, full sale, you guys are telling us go in and you know try to break it, um, find all the the fields that aren't mapped the way that you expect them to, or they're not updating the way that you you think they should be. Um, we don't need any coding experience. Like I said, we're not developers. We didn't need to be. Um, the black box, like the user interface, was just a super easy tool to use. Um, we can get in there and we can you know really easily see what fields. We have mapped. Uh, if there were errors along the way, you know, the the user interface is just a very easy tool for us to navigate. And then, um, you know, if we have questions or if we have a little bit more advanced mapping needs, like some of the fields may not be just a, a one for one between ADP and Vantage Point. You may have some some logic built into there. Um, we could always reach out to our uh, full sale developers, and they're always you know super quick, super responsive, getting back to us. And um, you know, I think. I don't think there was actually a single um, field that we had between the two databases that they weren't able to, to connect somehow. And we we thought we were pretty special. We thought we had some you know really fun, different ways of, you know, if this in ADP, then this in Vantage Point, and they're able to, to take care of all that for us. It was, it was awesome. All right. And so now that you've implemented um, the black box connector for ADT, ADP, what goals have you achieved or what goals were achieved by, by implementing this solution? For one, uh, the HR department's duplication work just cut out entirely. Um, they're no longer having to, to go into both places to update an address here and an update an address in here. Um, so their lives are much easier. I know that they are very appreciative of having that, that connector now. And so it's less on their plate. Um, but probably more importantly, just cutting out those inconsistencies. Uh, you know, I said earlier how 
we really wanted to value our data and we really wanted to know that we're looking at right information. It's, you, you can't make business decisions if you're looking at bad data or old data or just inconsistent data between you know different databases. And so that black box connector was just really able to to make our lives easier. And it was you know cutting those inconsistencies out so we could actually trust that the data that Vantage Point is giving us is real and it's right. All right. And then in your opinion, what is the most significant advantage that your firm has gained because of this solution? Um, it's having the data we can trust. Um, you know, cutting out the duplication of work was it's great. Uh, it frees up the individual time to, to focus on something else. You know, the HR department, they're not having to, to devote as much time to just simple data entry. But really, I'd say at the end of the day, just having that confidence in the information is what matters most to us. And you know, we couldn't be happier that we've got the black box connector running for us just because it's it's giving us trustworthy data. And that's, that's what we love. I love it. All right. So let's um, shift gears a little bit. So um, you might have already answered this, but um, the, for the post implementation of uh, the benefits, so how did the implementation or the services of this um, solution benefit your firm or your company? I feel like I just keep saying it over and over again, but it's just having the data that that is right. Um, we, we can look at project information now. We can run a project profit report and vantage point that has those employee costs in there. And we can know like, all right, this is the true cost of our of our people working the project. Um, employees can can get into either system and look at their information and they know that that is right or they can you know fill out a request to ask HR to, to update their address or if they got a promotion like it's it's knowing that wherever like if it's knowing that they can look in either system and believing that it's right and not having that that question or not filling out a request and you know hoping that they see it updated in the place it needs to be soon but it's all right away. And so uh, the HR department being able to to go into ADP and they can make one update then and then forget about it. They don't need to try to remember to go back and make sure it gets updated somewhere else too, just because that black box connector, it's set up to refresh every night. Um, so any change in ADP is updated in vantage point the next day. And so just giving us good real-time data. Before I leave, uh, let you go today, do you have any other like final thoughts or um, anything else you wanted to say that you didn't get out? Um, yeah. I, I feel like I even, I said this too, but I mean, it was just, it was just a, a breath of fresh air. Um, I think this was kind of a, a project that we had been wanting to to take on. Um, so I guess it would have been back in November, whenever we went to the project con, we you know, saw the solution, but we didn't actually start, input, they didn't start actually uh you know, rolling it out didn't start the implementation process until Q2 of this year. And so it was something that we were kind of nervous about. You know, we thought like, oh, this is this is going to be a, a big thing. It's going to require a lot of time to, to roll out and to do testing. And that wasn't the case. Um, our, you know, full sale developers were always really quick to respond. If we had questions, you know, we were able to get right in and you know, test between the two databases. And it was just the process itself was just a lot smoother than we could have imagined. And then the benefit, like we, we knew that there was a huge benefit to, to having something like this, but actually just see it, seeing it in action and just seeing just how, how much easier it makes everyone's lives knowing that we have good data is, I, mean, I can't speak highly enough about it.